I, George Peterson here from Front of House. We've got a, a great issue for you this month, starting with our coverage of The Who's Moving On Tour, where Eighth Day Sound rocked North American arenas with a huge Adamson rig. Our show report looks at the product hits of Infocom 2019. We present our picks for the hottest new technology debuts from last month's show in Orlando. Don't miss it. Our installation focus looks in on Nashville's Cannery Row, where Thunder Audio takes the performance spaces in this historic complex to a new level with versatile, all-RCF sound system. In our theater sound feature, The Dark Side of Oklahoma, Brian Reisman chats with sound designer Drew Levy about shaping audio for a very different revival of this Broadway classic. Our buyer's guide this month focuses on custom IEM earpieces, checking out some current offerings in high-performance in-ear monitors for professional applications. In this month's tech feature, David Kennedy chimes in on aspects of the sound pressure level wars. We also visit German speaker manufacturer HK Audio, which, with a distribution deal with Yorkville Sound and a lineup of new high technology products, has its sights on the American market. This month's road test checks out the PreSonus Studio Live 64S, their flagship digital console, which packs 76 mix channels, 43 buses, and 526 simultaneous effects processors into a compact, affordable package. There's a lot more in this month's issue of Front of House, whether you read it online, in print, or with our way cool, free iPad edition. But wherever you go, whatever you do, don't piss off the sound guy.